welcome to my Concord X Custom INS Flight Plan Con tutorial. Uh, as you may know, Concord X is one of the most advanced and accurate aircraft simulations ever created for Flight Simulator X. And because of that, you cannot use the Flight Planner that's in Flight Simulator X to create your own custom route. So let's say that you want to go to somewhere else than from London Heathrow to New York's John F. Kennedy or another route or shuttle route that's included in the product. But that can be a little bit tricky. So we're gonna go ahead and make our own INS navigation card. So we're going we are going to use two different programs. One is called Flight Sim Commander 9, and another one is Plan Converter. So we're gonna go ahead and start Flight Sim Commander 9 up. We are now going to select which airport Flight Sim Commander is going to show us when the program launches. Uh, this tutorial will be from Barbados to Gran Canaria, and here we already have Barbados International Airport, or Grantley Adams International Airport, as our departure airport. So here we just press select. Then the program launches, and it shows us Barbados. Then if we zoom out a little bit, we see Barbados here, and Gran Canaria over here. We're now going to go ahead and create our flight plan. Then you just go up to flight plan, you click on new, and this box appears, which eventually will show us our flight plan on our flight plan information. Uh, go to select airport, and here we are going to select our departure airport, which is already set to Grantley Adams International Airport. So we just have to click on select and it automatically switches to destination and our destination is Gran Canaria so we are going to type in the airport code for Gran Canaria International Airport which is GCLT then you press on search and it shows us Gran Canaria as our destination then you press select and close now here we have our flight plan, which goes directly from Barbados to Gran Canaria. So uh, we're going to zoom in a little bit on Gran Canaria here. By previous in, uh, experience, I know that it's rather hard to fly over the island, since the island is a rather high mountain. Uh, so we're going to set a virtual waypoint over here like that, so we can fly around the mountain and make a smooth controlled approach down to the airport. Uh, this is pretty much it, so just go to flight plan again and click on save. Then you create the name for your flight plan. This flight plan is going to be named TBPDGCLP. And then you just select which uh, directory you want to save your flight plan to. I have selected documents. So I just press save. And uh, then you can just close Flight Sim Commander. We are now going to open Plan Converter, which is the program that's going to convert our flight plan we recently made into a INS flight plan card that you can load into your inertial navigation system. So just locate your flight plan, select it, and here it is, open in the converter. You just have to press File and Export. I'm going to rename the flight plan to uh, yeah to just be TBPB GCLP. Then you just press save, and you can close this program. Here we have the navigation files. Now this is the AWC file, which is uh, going to be loaded into the inertial navigation system. Uh, here we have our waypoints. Like the first one is north 28, 23, 6, west 0, 15, 29. And uh, yeah, this is uh, pretty much it. This file is going to be dropped into Flight Simulator X main directory. Locate SIVA and ADEU. Here we have all Concord X flight plans. So we just right click, click paste. And here we have our custom minus flight plan card, which is from Barbados to Gran Canaria International Airport. Um, in a while, I will make a tutorial where I show you how to 
program the inertial navigation system and load this card in and uh, I will also show you how to correctly fly the Concorde from Barbados to Gran Canaria. Thanks for watching.